Hey, hey everybody, it's Mitchell aka Miri here doing the final part of the Great One, The Rock segment for the new, fairly new WWE 13 Attitude Era. Now, I don't know how long I'm going to make this video, but however long it is, I will be completing The Rock's uh, segments. So, in the last two videos, basically, I'll give you a recap of what gone on, just in case you've just found the video for the first time. Basically, the first two videos were me, tr The Rock, trying to get into the su Survivor Series Deadly Game Tournament for the WWF title. It is a tournament, and one time, one night only tournament, to, g to win the title. So, I had to go against Ken Shamrock to get in to keep my spot in the tournament, or the Rock's spot, to have to win the Intercontinental title from him. I won, but because the Rock didn't win the title, he won by DQ, he didn't get the, he lost his spot. So, I had to then go up against Mark Henry, and I beat him, and got my spot back. Then in the first match, the first round, I went up against, who was it? Uh, oh yeah, uh, the Big Boss Man beat him in under a minute, with four seconds to spare. Then in the second match, I beat Ken Shamrock, or I don't know how much, it had to be in under 8 minutes. I beat him, I wouldn't say fairly quickly, but I beat him. So now, I am going up against The Undertaker. I, I know you probably noticed there was a bonus match before this. That was, uh, I looked at it, I'm not going to be doing it, I'll probably do it in later videos, at, when I'm done with all this, but it was The Undertaker versus Kane. And if you don't know who won that bonus match, seriously, you need to get yourself checked out. But because I'm facing Undertaker right now, so the last match will be me versus uh, somebody. Most I'm not sure who it will be, but it'll be me versus uh, uh, bu -bu 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 -bu, like someone for the title. Because you know, whoever I am, they uh, win. So if I'm the, the Rock, then you know I make it to the finals. If I'm The Undertaker, you know I, I lose and uh, The Rock loses. So it's just it's pretty easy to figure it out. But So yeah, um, while I'm uh, playing the game, like I've always said, I am uploading videos to uh, YouTube. I will. This will most likely be the last part of the day. Um, this is the final part, like I said, of, uh, da 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 what is it, uh, of the great one. I know, it was a pretty quick, um, what's, uh, it was a pretty quick video, in my opinion, or a segment. I mean, I think this only took three parts, and I mean, I, I know they weren't that, they... To some people, they could be very hard matches. To me, these were very, very easy, and it really kind of sucks. It takes away, in my opinion, from the whole um, aspect. Like, these are supposed to be really hard, but I beat this, the whole Rocks. Uh, I'm probably going to beat the Rocks um, thing, and ooh hoo, hoo now I know why I wanted me to do the Rock Bottom. But um, it took me about... Ooh, ooh, am I going to win? Hey, hey, I won by DQ. It looks like uh, the Brothers of Destruction are back. So that must... I guess that leads into the last... Oh, ooh, hoo, hoo, knock out the... Oh, I spoke too soon. It looks like they're not back. I think this is what led to uh, WrestleMania match between Undertaker and Kane. I don't know. Again, don't quote me on it. That's going to be like my, my freaking catchphrase in this whole thing. Don't quote me on it because I'll say something out my ass or something. So, I guess I'm in the finals now, but, um, so like I was saying, here, yeah, I mean, to some people it might be easy, but to me, I mean, to hard, but to me this is very, very easy, so, this will be the last video I put up, uh, I put up videos pretty frequently, like, after every single one, um, and if you're watching this one now, I most likely the first two parts have gone up already. Um, they should have. If not, then I am terribly sorry. There's a huge problem. But um, so yeah, the first two parts should be up. And while 
I have this thing is going on. I'm I'm talking over the promo while the promo is going on. I'm looking up on you, my YouTube channel to see um, how if they're up or not. But as you can see right now, they're just recapping basically all of the matches. So it was Undertaker versus The Rock, where I am The Rock and I won, and then Mankind versus Stone Cold. I would have bet Stone Cold would have won that one, but I guess it's The Rock versus Mankind. So hopefully this will be quick and easy, and I can finish up this part. And, yeah, but knowing my luck, it's probably going to be about a four or five minute long match. So, me versus Mankind, win the match by pinfall or submission. Um, da -da -da, hit Mick Foley with the chair six times. Hit rock bottom. Hit the people's elbow. And I did not see what the last one was, unfortunately. I am a very slow reader. And... Uh, said get him into the the, 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 the the sharpshooter. I think, I'm not sure if that's a finisher or one of his, uh, uh, what's the word? Total brain for it over here. I'm not sure if that was one of his finishers or, uh, signatures, that's the word. So, I'm probably going to try out the finisher first and see how that goes. But, I, to be honest, I didn't even know he had a sharpshooter as a, um, as one of his moves. I would have bet money, it, it would have been like one of his, uh, just normal moves, but, what a shock, I'm wrong again. So, get used to that, you guys. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so I just checked, and all my, vi my videos are up. Uh, this will be the third and final part of The Rock, like I've been saying. Because uh, I, I believe this is the final match. If it's not, then that's kind of interesting. Because usually, once they win the title or lose the title, they get it. So, I love taunting. It gets your signature up pretty quickly. And I need to hit three sing two finishers and either a signature or a finisher, I'm not sure. So... I'm going to have to be doing a lot of taunting, either that or doing a lot of top rope moves like you see. I, uh, I, I just, I don't know how, some, what I think is funny is some superstars nowadays, they don't go up to the top rope, so how do they choose the top rope moves that they do for, I don't know, like, um, let's think of something, Undertaker, he very rarely, I don't think he ever goes to the top rope. So, what do they do for the Undertaker in the game when he has a top rope move? Like, uh, I mean, even The Rock, I don't think he ever went to the top rope. So, what do they pick? Do they just ask him, hey, if we're going to make you do good top rope, mo top rope moves. Uh, what do you want your moves to be? Like, something like that? Or, I mean, you can't really just make up something. So, I mean, they got to, like, maybe they did it once and they just stuck with it or they asked them, but it's like, the Rock or the Undertaker never went to the top rope. I don't even think Triple H did, yet they have Triple H do top rope moves. So it's like, what do they do? But, yeah. Uh, so I just, looking at the the objectives, this is probably going to be a long video because I have to get through either two or three finishers, so it will be a little hard. Come on, come on, come on. I'm on the ropes. Come on, Raph. You should be able to break it. All right, I'll be... Right back, you guys. I'm going to take a quick drink of some Mountain Dew. Ah. Nope, it's Diet Mountain Dew. Whatever, same thing. Actually, um, I went to 7-Eleven today to get the Mountain Dew. And I don't know why, but I saw an advertisement for that new Halo double XP thing. And once I watched that, I was like, oh god, I've got to get a Mountain Dew now. So I actually got two of them, a diet and a normal one. And the guy actually asked me, you know that it's one's diet, one's mount, uh, normal. I'm like, yeah, I know. He's like, okay, just checking. I'm like, I mean, they're in two different spots. I mean, I wouldn't have, if I really didn't know, if someone really put one in the same spot, like a diet and a normal one, then maybe you could have done it, but they were in completely two different areas. So I don't get why they even asked, why he even brought that up, but whatever. I mean, to be honest, he was, I've never been to a 7-Eleven where the guy was actually friendly, and that guy was friendly, so I thought it was kind of, like, strange. So that's two objectives down, but, um, so yeah, it was a fun little experience going to 7-Eleven. 
at, well, I don't know, like seven in the seven or eight in the morning. Gotta love having your own car and having a 7-Eleven about a mi two miles away from your house. I know walking turns, that's a lot, but driving, that's like there in two minutes. I actually, I was uh, playing uh, some my, my music in my car, and it was actually, from the song, it was only about a five-minute drive, so that's pretty good. Now, I need to get the sledgehammer into his stomach like that, and I need to get my signature back quick. Yeah, I took another swig. Sorry, guys. I want you to go through this announce table, so get your butt over here. So, actually, while I was uploading, not, ah, shit. I don't get it. How do they reverse it? It's like, I do the move first. Why do they get to DDT me through the table? Whatever. But, um, as I'm actually recording these, <laughs> the last few videos, I think this will be the fourth video I put up today. I was supposed to be working on an essay for school. Yeah. As you can tell, it's not gonna, it's, I have really haven't gotten that done. But the the really bad thing is this that essay's due today. Luckily, um, once this video goes up, I'll be done with it. So that's a positive note. But, but yeah, that just shows how much I love putting up these videos. If I'd rather uh, not do my sc my essay for college before I put this up. So you guys should feel honored that I'm uh, putting this up instead of doing an essay. Cause I wasn't. I was actually probably just gonna put up one video. And then I was like, you know what, I'm almost done with the essay, why don't I just put up some more and see where it takes me. And four videos later, I still don't have my essay done. Woo! Gotta love college, don't you? Just sitting around playing video games and eating Top Ramen. <laughs> and uh, cold pizza, that's it, that's the other one. Cold pizza, that stuff's the best, especially in college. But yeah, um, so, I'm just beating up Mc, uh, Mankind right now with the title, I'm rubbing his, that is so stupid, it should be the other way around, I'm not rubbing it on the, uh -oh, Vince McMahon's coming out, what the hell, hmm. but um, I shouldn't be rubbing his face on the part where you attach to your butt, it should be rubbing it on the part like, where the face is, that part would hurt like hell, <laughs> yeah, Jerry the King Lawler and uh, Jim Ross are out in the front, so, um, yeah, this is going up on Tuesday, and Raw yesterday, actually, Jerry the King Lala came back, and what really sucks is I was out with my girlfriend, and I never saw the beginning of it. I did see, um, that later in it, uh, I saw the Ryback versus Brad Maddox match, and that was just a squash match in my opinion, but, um, I actually was so beat after the day, I did not see the, the main event. And I actually fell asleep in my clothes. Completely clothed. Pants, jacket, everything. Not shoes, I took those off. But I was literally sleeping in my bed with everything on. And I woke up at like 6.30 in the morning. Like, what the hell just happened? So I actually went up on the WWE.com. Uh, come on, come on, don't revert. Come on, hit him. There we go. I went on the WWE.com to check out what happened. And I guess, uh... Ryback came out to help John Cena win, and to be honest, I mean, they had Ryback be one of these tough guys, it's like, he doesn't get, he doesn't care about the title, he just wants to beat people up, now they kind of have him, like, he cares about the title, so it's like, stick with one thing, I mean, they kind of set it up like, you want, he does, he just wants to kill CM Punk, he doesn't care if he doesn't win the title, okay, come on, let's see if, come on. Ah, crap. Shoot. I guess it's a signature. Woohoo, almost onto the sledgehammer. Well, I guess the sharpshoot is a signature, so I'm going to have to beat him up again some more. But, the, I mean, like I was saying, the Ryback, they made him be like, I just a beat him up type of guy like Goldberg. But Goldberg actually wanted a title. Ryback, they set it up so he didn't want it. Now it's like he's fighting for the title, actually. It's like... How do you go from losing one match to now I gotta... From the... You undefeated, you wanna beat people up, and then... You... Lose your first match, and now you wanna win the title. It's like... Uh, kind of a flaky type of combination, but... 
WWE hasn't really been doing so hot lately, but I'm definitely gonna, after work on Sunday, I'm gonna be watching, um, I'm gonna try to watch the, the pay-per-view. What is it? Yeah, it's Survivor Series. To be honest, all I'm really gonna do is watch for the main event. I mean, I don't really care so much about the uh, about the eliminate the typical Survivor Series elimination tag. I don't really care that much about it, unfortunately. I just want to see how the WWE is gonna wiggle uh, screw up this one. If they're gonna have CM Punk win and have The Rock beat him at the Royal Rumble, are they gonna have uh, Ryback win and then CM Punk steal it back or? Do like John Cena versus <clears throat> John Cena win it and have him versus The Rock? I mean, they probably wouldn't do that again. But I mean, I, yeah. So, uh, it, a lot of people are just uh, are just like this is so screwed up. You, everyone knows, just knows CM Punk's gonna win because they have CM Punk in the um as first thing. Uh, the Rock at Royal Rumble, so they know Ryback's not gonna win. They know C Cena's not gonna win. So it's like, why do they even have the match? Why don't they just do that stupid traditional Survivor Series tag match? Oh crap! Kick out! Kick out! Kick out! Go! Oh, shit! 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 Oh, oh, oh. oh my God! I was that was way too close. I was about to flip out. But um, yeah. So they know who's gonna win. It's so stupid in my opinion, but. Whatever. So, I'll still watch it though. I want to see how they do it, but whatever. I really need to get this stupid signature in quick. God. I'm getting my ass kicked over here. Uh, not my ass kicked. I'm. Well, I am getting my ass kicked trying to get set up the stupid signature. I just need to get it back and to get on his freaking. by his freaking legs, but I'm having trouble with that. But yeah, so we all know CM Punk's gonna win. I want to see how they're gonna do it. Maybe because they can't really do a DQ or a ref screw job because they got three guys in the match, so there's no disqualification, and they have a, a third member so that if Ryback gets screwed or Cena gets screwed, one of the other two will come in and fix it. Oh, okay, here we go. So yeah, okay. Now I need to get them to submit. I'm really sucking at this. So hold on, come on, come on, come on. Almost there. Almost. Come on, come on. What the hell? the hell? It wasn't even at the breaking point. I'm so confused right now, but... Oh, I get it. He, uh, teamed up with Mr. McMahon to form, uh, I guess the corporation, what it was called. I can't believe I forgot that. I'm kind of stupid. But, <laughs> Mankind's probably going to be like, What the hell? What's going on? I thought you left me. Yeah, yeah, see? He's like, What's going on? I'm so confused. But, so, that was definitely a very, very, very short um, uh, segment for the, the great one. Granted, there were six matches, but granted, those were very, very, very short matches. I mean, I one of the videos was only like eight, seven or eight minutes long, and I mean, the first match was only a minute long, so I mean, hey... Hopefully, next year, if they do something like this, try and do it a little bit better, in my opinion. It, I mean, try not to do some short matches like this. I mean, sometimes you don't have any choice, but, I mean, try to make some long matches, if you can. Or, WWE for future, try to uh, set it up so that the matches don't go for very, very sh short amounts of time. But, I can't control that. WWE has all the control over that, but, whatever. It's like, I'm just a pawn in their game. I'm watching them. So, hoo-hoo. Taking down Mick with the... Or Mankind with the title. But, as always, you guys, thank you so much for watching the the final part of the great one. I will be uploading next one, which I'm not sure what it is, but I'll upload it tomorrow. So, thanks again so much for watching, you guys, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye